Hi, I'm Matt from AirOps. By now, you've probably heard about OpenAI's GPT-4 vision model and some of the mind-blowing ways people are using it. Today, I'm going to show you an incredibly powerful way to use GPT-4 vision within AirOps that lets you take any image and extract structure data directly into a Google Sheet. You'll never have to copy and paste and reformat tables from PDFs or manually transcribe information from a website or other document again. Let's dive in. All right, here we are in the AirOps platform. Now time to show you how to use the image to data template that will help us get data from images into Google Sheets. So we'll click explore templates. We'll scroll to the bottom here where our image templates are located. We'll select this one, which is image to data. This will drop us into the AirOps studio where we can configure our workflow exactly to our needs. We're gonna go with the kind of standard template as it is here. It's pretty straightforward. It accepts either a image URL or an image file. What we'll do is we'll have a, an LLM step. This will use the GPT-4 Turbo Vision model. We'll have a prompt that basically gives the instructions of you know, find the tabular data in this uh, image and then turn it into a list of objects. That list of objects is really important to get it into a format that we can then easily flatten into a Google Sheets table to then be able to analyze. Give it a user assistant pair here. So kind of simulating what we're gonna ask the LLM to do and then give it some instructions on the format of any quantitative data that we pull through into the table. And lastly, conditionally ask for either the image URL or the image file to be analyzed. The last step here is to actually integrate and have the Google Sheet that we're creating go to the right folder. So parent folder, we'll click image to data test. This will be ordered by the most recently edited folders in your, in your uh, Google Drive. Here, we'll refer to step four output. So the output is what the, the array that we're gonna turn into a table here. And then we'll save changes. And then in order to test this, I'm going to use the income statement of the meta most recent 10K. So here, just to, to make the image a little smaller, I'm going to shrink this a bit and then take a screenshot, use an image URL if you want, of this. And now let's try testing the app. So I will say test all. Image URL, I'm gonna choose a file and then I'm going to do the recent screenshot and then hit execute. Give it a second here. This should be able to create a formatted Google Sheet in the folder that we selected. There we go. All right, moment of truth. There you have it. So we have the income statement of Meta broken down just as we saw it on the, the image. Last thing we'll do, we'll go ahead and publish this app and then we can run it either from the main screen or we could connect this in any number of ways. You know, we could run this in a batch if we had a bunch of images that we wanted to process. We could run this via an API call as well. And so we'll do another video on how to use image with an API step or, or do in bulk as well as those are very frequently asked for use cases. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to our AirOps YouTube channel where we have lots of great, totally free tutorials on building with AI. If you liked this video in particular, I'd suggest watching our video on using AI to generate and iterate on prompts within the AirOps platform, which can help you speed up your time to great outcomes with LLMs. Thank you.